Now, though, a search for a driver who struck and killed a cyclist and then just took off. It was a fatal hit and run. It happened this morning at 20th and Grant on the city's south side. Police are asking for help finding a blue Jeep Liberty. You see it right here. It will have front end damage and maybe a broken front windshield. A witness tells Stephanie Haynes steps need to be taken to make that interchange safer. Just before 1130 Friday morning, Robert was standing outside his apartment at 20th and Grant when he spots a man heading his way on a bike. And I tried to yell at him like, hey, a car. I yelled it twice. And it was just too late. There was no braking because he was like, you know, too close to the corner and the blue, the blue Jeep Liberty was going about 40 and they collided. Robert didn't want to show his face on camera. He is traumatized by what he saw. I have to be OK because, you know, I'm still here. He's not. His roommates came running down and called 911. I was talking to him like, can you hear me? Can you hear me? And he wouldn't respond. Milwaukee police say the SUV took off and a man died at the scene. They believe he's in his 30s and they are still trying to identify him. The picture shows the car police believe was involved. They think it came north on 20th and then went east on Beecher. It's a 2002 to 2007 Blue Jeep Liberty SUV. It may have damage to the front end and possibly the windshield. Meanwhile, Robert is thinking about the man's loved ones. There's nothing that you can say to a grieving family at this moment besides I'm sorry for your loss and I hope that you can heal from this loss. We don't know who the man was, how many kids he had, if he had kids, if he was a provider for his family. It just looked like he was coming back from getting some nice dress slacks. I remember gray dress slacks and a nice shirt. He doesn't want anyone to go through what he says he saw, and he wants the intersection to be a four-way stop. I think a stop sign here would be, it would make the most sense, you know what I mean? Because like, like I said, there's, there's four blind spots on this corner. In Milwaukee, Stephanie Haynes, TMJ4 News. And take one more look at that SUV involved in this hit and run. It is a blue Jeep Liberty. Years 2002 to 2007 with front end damage. If you have any information, please call Milwaukee Police. They want to hear from you.